Well, we started our day with some high clouds coming in and made for a pretty sunrise at Rockport. Uh, taking a look at the computer, we'll see that. There it is, beautiful morning here in Rockport looking toward the water. As we went through the day, the skies cleared a bit with some cumulus clouds, and then we see these high thin clouds coming in back from the east heading toward the west tonight. Uh, those should make for a pretty sunset this evening as we get into 827. The sun will be setting. If you happen to have your camera out, take a picture for me and you can send that in. You can also get a shot of that moon. It's rising at 833. So as the sun is setting, we're going to have the moon rising. Give it a few minutes though to get above the horizon. It may take a good 10, 15 minutes before you see it. The planet Saturn to the upper right of the moon tonight. It's not quite as close. So you should be able to see Saturn better since it's not going to be directly in that moonlight. And then Jupiter much brighter and to the upper right. So if you want to share your photos, please do. You can put them on our Facebook page at KZTV Action 10 News or, or my Facebook page. You can share them with me on Twitter or just send me an email and I'll be sure to get those on the air. We have those high clouds. Here they are. That's what I was just showing you. You see how they're coming in from the ocean right now and then those other speckled clouds there, those cumulus clouds we see on a daily basis. The temperatures right now anywhere from 88 at the Naval Air Station to 92 Corpus Christi in Robstown and the heat indices at 108 at Kingsville. Look at Alice. It's steamy again. 111 today and that heat index at 105 at Ingleside and the wind around 20 miles an hour. Good breeze blowing out there today. I saw gusts as high as 30 this afternoon, and I do expect more of that tomorrow in the wind forecast. You can see it continues all the way into the weekend, starting to come down though a little bit by Sunday and Monday as that wind starts to shift to the east by Monday. So tonight's low is dropping down to near 80. Another warm night, partly cloudy out there tonight. Good breeze blowing. Tomorrow, if you're taking the dog for a walk, well, the mornings are always the best time when it's not so hot. You can see up to 89 by 11 o'clock, not 1 o'clock at 92 degrees. The heat index though 104 by 1 o'clock with that high humidity and you can see how the breezes pick up again tomorrow. Very similar to what we saw today. High temperatures across the area, 98 tomorrow at Beeville and George West, 99 Alice and 95 Corpus Christi, feeling that heat and humidity as we would expect here for mid-July. On the water, the beaches, we're looking at three to four foot waves tomorrow. The moderate rip current risk with that wind will continue the next couple of days as we do see a partly cloudy sky at the beaches again tomorrow. So quiet weather pattern right now. We don't see much happening here. You can see just how dry it is across the area while the remnants of Barry continue to push across St. Louis and now pulling off to the north and east. Bands of heavy showers continuing along that boundary. Uh, that'll continue moving to the east northeast. So as Barry is weakening and take and moving out, there's no additional tropical formation expected in the next five days. Uh, so nothing expected to develop except for some possible rain here. Boy, do we need it. And that would be early next week if this wave holds together. There's an upper level wave that's going to travel toward us. We're dry Sunday, you can see here. But well, watch by Monday and Tuesday. We start to see some showers develop. That's if that holds together. And that'll be something I'll keep watching through the week as we'll hope for that rain early next week as that wave moves in. Here is a seven day forecast then. As far as the next few days, it's dry. Except for a stray shower, it looks like we're looking at temperatures in the mid 90s and then heat indices up to 110 and that chance of rain early next week.